I want to talk to you about hitting the proverbial dieter's plateau. Now, first and foremost, I want you to know that it's completely expected and it's supposed to happen. Keep this in mind. Our body, it's this incredible machine that's made to adapt to everything that we do. And so anytime that we're going to create a calorie deficit, which is typically what most of us call a standard diet. So we're going to create a calorie deficit and we're losing weight. Your body is actually trying to, um, create some kind of resistance to that. And ultimately it is inevitable that your body will adapt to that uh, calorie deficit and it will plateau. Now keep in mind, you're not stuck when you're actually at the plateau. It's, it's a beautiful thing because it, it shows you exactly where your body is in the process. And there's a lot of different things you can do. If, for example, you can actually uh, begin exercising. If you haven't started exercising already, you can increase the frequency of the, the days that you exercise every, every week, or you can increase the intensity of your exercise. You can increase the time at which you exercise or the type of exercise. So instead of say walking, you might move to cycling. So keep switching it up when it comes to the actual nutrition aspect of it. One of the things I recommend, and it sounds a little bit unorthodox is take a day or two off, or sometimes even take a week off the diet feed yourself again, rest and relax your body, and then jump back on. And believe it or not, your body will begin to start losing weight again. It's the easiest way to break through the plateau.